Hello, welcome to my first proper Minecraft video, which is going to be the first in a in a series with lots of few episodes, which is going to be a guide of my world in different stages. What you're seeing now in this stage is what I'm calling Carrier Pre, which because I'm doing an absolute makeover of the world at the moment, because at the moment my it's all unorganized and you know i've seen other people's houses in minecraft and my house just looks you know rubbish compared to you you can actually see over there a sheep giant sheep I haven't got around to finishing because i kind of neglected it about and hopefully it's not going to burst into flames that'd be pretty bad but i have backups anyway That's my what in the area is just underneath my tower which as you can see has lava coming from it I'll talk about that in a second, I just want you to see this for a minute. This area here is this let me move the tree. This area here is the main scenery is when you leave my cave, it's pretty much what you see. You got my bridge over there, you got my dock in the corner, your giant sheep's over there. Now this lavatar is one that has caused me quite a lot. It's actually pretty funny this lavatar, it's caused quite a lot of entertainment. In uh Whenever I built it and put the lava there, I didn't realise the effects the lava had on trees and there was a massive forest fire. Every tree you've seen in this video so far in this area has been placed by me from the from, from sapling because all the original trees went up in flames. That was, it was just like whenever I... I remember my expression at the time when I was looking down from my tower at the fire just spreading. I was like, oh god, no. I'm going to have to fix this. It took me forever to fix that lava and get it flowing like that. Like, if you've ever dealt with lava before in Minecraft, you know how difficult it is when it gets out of hand. Now I'm going to go into my, my main my cave. I wouldn't call it a house yet. That's what this series about is called from cave to castle. Where I've taken this in my original base. What looks pretty much like a cave at the moment with some features like that and then turn it into a proper looking house you know you walk in this cave now you think cave you walk in look when i'm done you're going to walk into this and think castle like the moment is just a rough guide showing me things like the mushroom farm the the sugarcane farm the wheat farm the levered open mushroom farm the sandstone ground there this is my first cave i'll probably show that in a different video later on at some point not high priority. I, I, I haven't mentioned it, it says Minecraft 1.73. Yeah, beta 1.73 because it's not in the core anymore, you wouldn't know. I I probably the golden skull there is the entrance to my cave. And I know this is gonna sound kind of on synced, but considering this isn't a live recording, this is pre is a pre recorded tour which I've done and I now, now talking to you while watching my own recording because I can't really to try for me using the equipment I have to try and get something synced is really difficult. Now what you're seeing, which I think it is the world when it was first born without me touching it at all. I haven't moved a single block in this is the same world but I haven't moved a single block. You know the scenery is similar but if you can act, if you compare I'll if you compare the two side by side you can see the difference. You know, I'll I'll do, a I'll do a side by side comparison at the end of this video. You'll be able to see it. But that cave there, I f I'm not quite sure what happened to it. Like it's like whenever I say it, whenever I first spawned the primal world, I hadn't had never done it before. Like and it's been months since I originally created the world and all that. Like I I just I I originally thought this isn't my world because it was just. Sorry about that. So different. It was completely different from the world I remember it being. And I just, until I got closer, until I got up here, I was like, oh, right. I'm starting to, like a lot of natural landmarks, about half of them have remained intact. So that's how I was able to realise that. At first, I was like, this is my world. Then I was like, oh, wait, it is. It's like, my cave here. Let me just get to you. Like this cave, whenever I, 
you can't see it in my old video whenever I spawn my primal world and find this Kiev. I was like, I don't remember this Kiev. Good, I just, I don't know what happened to this Kiev. It's just gone. I must have destroyed it or something, but it's gone. Now, let's just, the video is about to end. Now, I'll go on to the side by side comparison. Thank you for watching.